Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Cap and welcome back to the channel. We're on day 28 of our Darkness Falls playthrough here. We're still over at Eve's place. I have enough gas to get this thing going, basically. So is it a smart idea for me to take it out and about? No, not necessarily. But I'm going to try my best to drive this without using the sprint button, turbo, you know, to make it maybe not use as much gas. And if I could not run into things, that'd just be great too, since I don't have any repair kits. In retrospect, it probably would have been a smart idea to bring my mini bike with me since it has a full tank of gas. Or at least, wait, do I even have a bicycle? I don't even have a bicycle. Never mind. I was going to say bring a bicycle with me so I could pedal my happy butt around. But nope, I don't even have one of those. In retrospect, there's all things I could have done differently that would have been a little bit more beneficial than the way we're doing things. Sub goat. I'll tell you what, I'll leave you alone. Uh, nah. Oh, uh, let's see. I put my one skill point into living off the land level, not this one. Let me see, living off the land, this one. That way I can get three additional items from crops. You know, I figured that would kind of help out. And I bought myself some pancakes. One of my food goes back down. I have something that can kind of boost it up. Since I pretty much went through all my jerky. Um, but yeah, uh, I, I, I don't know if I should have... I did have some people say, hey, Cap, before you left town, why did you fill up your mini bike instead of just putting all the gas into your motorcycle? And the main reason why is because I knew that I would probably come back and not really have that much gas left. And I didn't want to get back and be like, oh, crap, now I don't have any for the mini bike at all. Wait a second. Hang on. Does it? Isn't this place have there's usually like barrels around here, I think, that has gas in it. Let me see. Um, I know that the, uh, there's a barrel right there. It's probably like murky Never mind. I was going to say it's mur like murky water, but never mind. There's usually like gas barrels around this thing, isn't there? Oh, there's a couple right here. Please have a lot. 11 and 30. <laughs> That's not a lot, game. Okay, well, let's head upstairs and see if there's anything up top. Hang on. Let's see if we can get a sneak shot through the stairs without making a bunch of noise. Technically, we did. Boink! Oh, crap. There we go. Now lay your happy butt down. Okie dokie. Did you have anything good up here with you? Some cornmeal? Sure, I'll take you. 41 units of gas is better than zero extra units of gas, I guess. Oh, there is a hatch down here. Um, Hang on. Let me make sure that I have this reloaded because I guarantee there's... Yeah, there's that idiot right there. Oh, he's just a regular old utility worker. We didn't get a sneak shot on him. There's one over there, though. He's a feral, so I definitely need to probably switch over to something with a little bit more bang. Oh, crap! <laughs> Dang it! Oh, no! Oh, you've got to be kidding me! Son of a biscuit! Look what you did. I'm blaming you on that one. I cannot believe that we just fell off. I came out of the hatch and I was... Oh, that was so stupid. Don't I have a... Don't I have a cast on me? I think I do. I have one right there. Good God, Cap! Come on, man. <laughs> I know, right? I mean, at least I have that sprain or have that casted up now so that it'll heal faster. Cannot believe we got the click. Where are you? Did you fall back down here? I cannot believe that just happened. I mean, I can because come on. Is there anybody in here? You're still in here. Was there anything even in here? There's some there's a shale spot right there. I guess uh, you had a little bit of food with you. Maybe something good. Another can of shaman. That's definitely a good way to get some poison. Murky water. I'll just drink you. And then the rest of that I'll just leave behind for the next person. This I definitely want to stomp away on just for a minute just to get some more shale. Because we have a decent chunk now. But if I could get a whole lot more, that'd be great. Of course, if I could find a working chemistry station, that'd be fantastic too. What I really want to... What I really want to do... Is there a room under there? No, it's just the way the box is. What I really want to do is try and get as much done from Eve as humanly possible. I don't know how many total quests they have. I do know that they progressively get harder and that like the last quest you do from her is just dumb levels of, you know, there's just dumb levels of ways to die in there. And I don't really need any additional. See, that's what happens. I came out and I was like, whoopsie daisy and fell right off the top of there. We can take that fall. Maybe not. I swear I used to be able to take a bigger fall. Maybe I could not. I do want to I originally stop because I wanted to take apart this truck. Nice. A little bit more gas. A little bit of iron. Hey, Edgar, did you see that? That shot. 
Okay, I want to take this apart and see if we can get some more gas. It's not a ton, but it's a little bit. We'll go ahead and put you in there, put that on there. That'll get it up to 44%. I'm pretty sure that's more than what we had when we first left. I'm okay with that. That's not terrible. And something else is this mission that I'm coming over here is just a find the supply. So realistically, I could just run in, grab what I need to get, and get my happy butt out of there. Because like I said, I would like to be able to finish all of Eve's quests and then head back to the house. If I don't get to head back until tomorrow, because driving after night, after hours in Darkness Falls is really not super smart. Um, especially when you risk running out of gas and being out in the middle of nowhere and you got to stop and try and wrench down a thingamajig. It's not a good idea. And so I may just wait till the morning to head back if it ends up being really late. This, I don't, call me crazy, but this looks like it's going to be way more harder than it should be. <laughs> we'll check the random box out front. A little bit of iron. Tell you what, how about we check to make sure our weapons are reloaded before we just bust in there like we own the place. Search you again for a little bit of dye. Uh, tell you what, we'll make our we'll make our knife black. That looks kind of cool. Uh, oh, I thought that was a bag. Okay, so this is just to grab the supply thingy. Oh, uh oh, oh crap! No. Okay. So, so much for any kind of stealth and sneakiness. It ki Oh, God! Hey, what's up, dude? Freaking A, man. You kind of startled me. I'm not going to lie. Don't blow up, lady. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. There you go. Oh, blew her up like a pumpkin, though. Uh, scrap you, and I'll probably just scrap you for the parts here. Okay. So, we got a couple people that just random it randomly woke up and did their thing. Now, one of the things that I... Skeletor, can you just calm your balls for a second? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna beat on you, sir. There you go. Oh, nice. You brought me a, a little bag of goodies too. Thank you. Um, one of the things I need to do real quick is I need to drop off a bunch of this stuff, like all of that. That would probably be good. I'm going ahead eat my pancakes. I know I have stuff for a fact that I could probably get rid of or not have on me. It saves some space here, but eh, I'm okay for the moment. What I was going to say, what I need to do for my, I need to put it into, not scavenging, it's in, ah, uh, salvage operations. That's where I was going to do. I need to put it into the mechanic. Once I get this over here, salvage operations, then I can start re, uh, getting some better stuff or getting more resources for the same amount of stuff. So it's pointing down on this as to where I need to go next. So I just have to assume that there's a very large, very terrible bunker underneath me. And it's gonna be like super duper easy to get in there. Of course, you want me to go upstairs to go downstairs. I could just, hang on. Who's over here making all this noise? Glenn, can you not, sir? No shot. Okay, let's stay within the confines of this place and see if I wonder if I have go through all of this and I come out over there. I kind of want to just go in and get the stuff that I need to and get the hell out of here. You know what I mean? Uh, if I could not have to deal with this and get as much done as possible, that'd be great. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make my own path through here. Oh, hey. Um... Probably be a good idea if we didn't miss, too. There we go. Dude, just freaking taking a nap in there. Holy crap. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Gonna kind of lay you guys to waste here. Get you to go down. Hang on a second. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Tom brought some goodies for us. Level on the weapons has gone up. That's good. Okay. I hear some beating on the stuff over there. That's fine. I just want to get the supplies that they want me to get and get the H up out of here. And it's below me again. Let me guess. There's a hole down here. I'm going to have to jump in. And it's going to be real easy to get to. Right? 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 I hope so anyway. I know this is not the uh, the clever, not the correct way to go about doing this. I'm aware. But like I said, I want to get the supplies and get out of here so that we can go do some more quests for her as fast as possible. Ooh, that one's better than the one we have. And let's see. Business pants and dress shoes. We'll just scrap those down. Okay, who's over there rapping at my chamber door? Actually, you know what? We're real close to the front. Let's just run around and see that. I don't want them to figure out how to get in here while I'm digging a hole. 
Let's run around and see who's over here. Hello, Jiggles. Laid your happy butt down, didn't I? Go ahead and pick you up. I was able to cook the yucca that I got yesterday and the meat that I got and make some grilled meat so I at least have some food on me that's not the pancakes, just in case. Hang on, I might as well search you. Nope, don't need you. Okay, let's get everything reloaded just in case. And that's what happens. Game, you just randomly start spawning in some things, don't you? Let's see on the odds that we can get a super snelty kill here. There's one. Well, not that one. She's a feral. Hang on. Hang on. Don't be hitting my blocks, lady. I'm beating on my Legos here. Need to stop shooting over your head. Okay, are we good for half a second? Make sure we're good here for a second. I can't get down. There we go. Make sure there's not any more idiots over here. She brought us some gear. Ooh, a research note. Woo, we only need like a ton more of those. If you could, oh man, am I going to have to go down even further? Yeah, 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 yeah. He's excited about it too. Uh, who do we have here? Oh, it's just a regular old lab dude. Nut shot. Oh, we're going to go for the double dingleberry shot. Gotcha. Okay. That's actually good stuff. That's actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and use you since the rest of you don't scrap. I mean, you don't, you scrap, don't scrap. You don't stack is what I was trying to say. That's good stuff too. Do I have, did I pick up, I did pick up some vitamins. You know, let's go ahead and use those. Probably would not hurt keep us from getting the infection since we already got the break. Gurgle, gurgle. Okay. So maybe, just maybe. That doesn't sound good. Doesn't sound good at all. No. No. Stay down. It's the marching of the janitors down here. Go ahead and reload for a second. And there's the stuff that we need. And bonk. And down he goes. So go ahead and pick you up. And boom. Mission accomplished. That was probably the best possible way anybody who has ever gone through this before. Just saying, you know. They'll be studying this in classrooms for years to come on how to do it properly. First try. Man, I like being able to just do that easily. Oh, yeah. Shotgun. Sure, sure, sure. Scrap you. Uh, most of the rest of the stuff isn't things that I need, but I'll definitely take it. Crappy boots I don't need. Some more shale. Nice. Random food. Scrap you and scrap you for the pages. Bowl of murky water. I'll just use you. Uh, I'll take I'll take both of you because I got room right the moment. Where do you go? Probably not that direction. We can go back up the way we came, I think. Okay, we've got what we got. I mean, we got what we needed. Let me rephrase that. Another hammer and a better shovel. No, that's not a better shovel. It's just another shovel. Okay, well, let's see what's in Moe's. How about a how about a drone? It has been a long time since we've had a drone. I don't even see drones in other people's playthroughs anymore. Like, just just never see them. When they first added those to the game, I know Josh found one, like, the very first week that he was playing, and it was great. And then they nerfed it, but made it impossible to get it just by finding them. You can craft them, of course, once you get to a certain level. But, you know, when they were first added, everybody, including myself, was, like, super-duper excited about it. Because it was something new. And then they changed it up and now you can't even get one half the time. Did I? I did search you. I don't know. It's just one of those that's mildly disappointing that something so cool is so pretty much impossible to come by. Hang on. I need to remove that from there. Uh, I didn't pick up any more. No, I didn't pick up any more gas. Okay. There's a car right over there. You know what? Since it's here, we should probably rip it down. This will be another one of those instances. If I don't get it now... Along with this. If I don't get it now, then I'm going to regret it later. Looking around. Oh, there's a... There's a rad. You're pretty rad, dude. Pretty rad. The wind over here sounds like there's a tornado coming. You know how cool it would be? If there was, like, realistic, um, severe weather in this. I mean, the, the fun pimps, the developers of this game, freaking live in Texas. In the same general area I do. It would be kind of cool if just at random... You could get some tornadoes and stuff rolled through here. Some hail. Well, 
Yes and no. Because I know my luck, and if there was a random tornado or a hailstorm that bust through this game, it would 100% destroy whatever base that I had made. A lightning strike would set it on fire, especially if you're using the fire spread mod, which I'm not using in this series for no particular reason. I'm just not using it. But it would 100%, it would be like when I was playing Icarus. For those of you who watched those videos that I did there, I had the worst possible luck you could ever hope for in that game. The worst possible luck. All right, let me top you off a little bit of extra gas and put as much in here that'll stack. Scrap you. Sort you out just a little bit. So we got tools of things like this is a slightly better axe, but it doesn't have as much durability. So here, let me modify you real quick. Okay, good to go. We don't have a ton of gas still, but we have enough to be able to get back. I'm trying to drive without turbo and I have a lot of shale. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Look at a bunch of these barrels over here. These white ones, you have a pretty good chance of getting some gas from. Yep. Hey, Tim, you bastard. Dude, I'm over here. Crap, look what you did. Look what you did. Wow, that's okay. So we had the running of the janitors in the last one. Now we have the running of the Tims here. Hang on, hang on. I gotta reload. Y'all are chunky. Holy sweet Jeebus. Okay, okay. Nothing wrong with uh, retreating a little bit. Nothing wrong with that at all. I want to try and get the rest of these barrels. Are you a feral? No, you're just a regular. Did I, how did I turn my headlamp off? Oh, nice. How about a big stack of gas? Or a big chunk of nails? Oh. A little bit of gas, a little bit of gas, a little bit of more gas. Both of those are empty. Might as well stick my head in here and see if there's anything else in any of these other ones. I see some barrels underneath. Might as well. Oh, that's, oh, we have to go down there. Is there an easy way to get down there? An easy way to get up, down and up? We have to go down there for sure. Oh, this is going to suck. Hey, zombies. Man, this is definitely the depository of gas that I need here. Okay, so here's what I need to do. I need to... I need to... I need to make a way that I can get up and down real fast and easy-like. Okay, so if I did like this... Then like that. Then I got some stairs that I can get to this point. Let me look around. Okay, so I see... Looks like Walt's sleeping over there. We're not going to be able to get a one-shot kill. I can feel it. Especially if we don't hit it. Oh. oh, hey, what's up? Don't do it. Holy Jesus. Dude. What the hell, man? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Could y'all stop puking for a second? Holy crap, this is not good. Oh, my God. We got to get out of this hole. I cannot believe that just happened. Uh-oh. Don't blow up, dude. Okay, we just need to get out of this hole. Here. Hell. Oh, crap. Yep. Oh, yeah, indeed. Okay, so we got a little bit... Oh, crap. I'm stuck on this little lift here. Oh, good. There's a freaking radiated dog. Uh-oh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, God. Okay. Stand up. Not that way. Oh, my God. Floor it, Chief! That is a whole lot of F all that noise. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yes, I'm holding down. Oh, God. Okay, we got all kinds of terrible things happening. I hear a bird coming after me. The, the entire game is trying to really hard kill me right now. And it did a, a real good job of almost getting there. Oh, my God. I can't believe we survived that. Oh, my heart's like beating so hard. I'm surprised you guys can't hear it. Oh, okay, we can slow it down just a little bit. <laughs> we got an infection. Oh, hey, our uh, our broken leg is healed. Every other problem you could have is about to happen, though. Holy monkey! I cannot believe that. <laughs> I just can't believe that freaking happened. 
That was insane. I'm glad we didn't die. I'd feel real bad. Granted, we'd also be a tremendous distance from the house. Which, what I really should do is probably take a bedroll and put it down right over here. Just in case I die. So, you know, since my bike is actually here and stuff, probably a good idea. All that fuel that we could have had down there. And we didn't get any of it. Because one idiot had to cause a problem. I was able to put an extra 108 in there. Woo! All right, where's that good first aid kit that I have? I, I know I have one. Where's it at? There it is. Oh, I have a chunk of those because I brought them with me. Yeah. Go ahead and use you. It'll give me 30 on that. That's real good. Like, mm-hmm. Are we good? Oh, we went through a... Ch We're low on shotgun ammo. Former thug, once again, literally beating your ass. Okay, well, we... Oh, yeah, I need to... Hang on. I think I have what I need in here to fix my problem, too. We got some honey. You know, I can go ahead and take some painkillers. That'll give me a little bit of health and some damage mitigation. It's going to make me thirsty. I know there's a water hole around here somewhere. Someone's poisoned the water hole. But I do know, or at least I think... At this point, I hate to say I know anything. I cannot believe how that last room went. Man, I thought we were going to get a sneak in there, get a good supply of easy gas, but no. No, not at all. Okay, I know there's a bedroll around here somewhere. I saw it laying on top of something. I don't remember where I put it, though. Maybe, where was it at? I saw a bedroll laying around. I really did. I just don't remember where I saw it at. Because I was like, oh, I could just pick that up and put it right back down again. Oh, I didn't even search her nightstand. I'm going to take her cowboy hat and then go sell it to her. Oh, man. Sorry, a little, little bit. What uh, I, have. I want your gun. That is a well, beast of a gun. Impressed. You are impressed. Okay. Bundle skill notes. I still need those. I have a magnum at the house. Okay. Um, what other jobs do you have? The reward. Nine kilometers? the hell is this at hang on hang on i have no idea let me see where is it in reference to our home good god not anywhere close are you sure are you sure that's where you want me to go because i could i could go somewhere better if you want oh my god okay um uh, let me sell a couple things. I could use a couple dollars. That's really about it. See, I did make myself... Hold on, take these with me. Take this supplies because they're mine. I guess, realistically, we could head back to the house because you got nothing here. You did reset today, so let me see if you have anything good for me to buy. You know, realistically, I'm going to do this. I'm going to buy two of these. I just found a battery bank. I could use this, the electrical fence, wire it up a little bit and give me some shock help over the, um, over the thingy. That's a good deal. I agree. That is a good deal. I'm not going to worry about putting a uh, sleeping bag down. I guess we are heading out of here. Uh-oh. Sorry. Kind of swinging a miss there the first time. I apologize. Holy crap. Okay. Sorry. I'm, st I'm still trying to come down from the last thing that we just encountered. All right. So we managed to get a decent chunk of shale. How much, do we, how much did we get? I think I put it all in my bike. Let me see how much we ended up with over here. Shale, we got almost a thousand. That'll make a tremendous amount of gas. A, a really good supply of gas, I think. Really, really, really good supply. And then some other things are just basic resources we need, of course. We can sell some of this. We can use some of it to repair other things. All right. Um, I need... Oh, yeah, I need... Let me... Uh, no, I can't do it there. I, I thought I saw there was a small little water pond around here somewhere. Hang on, let's take care of Brittany real quick. Bonk. Bonk again. And bonk one more time. I swear there was like a... I drove right past it when we got here. Maybe not, but I thought I did. Mm, sure, I'll take you. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to hop on this vehicle, right, y'all? And we're going to try our best to make it back to the house. I cannot believe that that is nine kilometers away. 10 kilometers, basically. Let's round up here. We got a long drive to get back to the house. Oh, man. We can start making a ton of gas. There's a lot of vehicles that I do want to make. Like, I do know for a fact that there's, like, a helicopter. Because you make a helipad. I don't know what it's called. But there's other things besides just the, the gyrocopter to fly. But the problem is that you got to have the... Uh, 
Grease Monkey, all of that maxed out before you can really unlock any of the high level stuff. So yeah, there's a charger and there's all kinds of different vehicles and that sort of thing that's definitely good to have. And I would love to have as many of those vehicles as possible. But I also have to unlock the skill to be able to get the part before I can even make the parts here. So I got a long ways to go on that one. Screw you, B. Screw you very much. I need to find some water or I guess I can just drink some red tea to keep me from dying here. You know what? Hang on, let's do that real quick. It's only worth 25. It'll at least get it back up. Actually, look, we can just drink two of these. There we go. We took those painkillers and that dropped it down. Oh, hang on. Dropped it down by a lot. Might, might as well get this real quick. Eh, leather and a splint. You know us. We're probably going to need that pretty soon. Okay. Got a bit of a drive. Let's head back home, shall we? A nice little bit of gas and a repair kit. Sweet. Didn't make it very far, but I had to stop and go ahead and grab. I'm going to try and wrench down every vehicle I can on the way over here just to get as much gas as possible so I can ensure that we actually get home. Ah, extra 192 units. Top you off there. That'll get us to 45%. We'll continue on. Passed it when I was driving over here, and I see these uh, steam uh, the steam stacks for this. I'm guessing it's on like a nuclear plant. I really want to go through this, but I in no way believe that that would be an easy task, and I'm pretty sure that would be like a multi-day thing. And right at the moment, yeah, no, but I definitely want to come back over here sometimes because that looks like it'd be a lot of fun. There have not been too many actual cars along the road that we can stop and get fuel at here. I've stopped at every one that's parked on the road and tried to wrench some of them down. And unless it's a completed vehicle like this one that's absolutely put together, you get like no gas at all from it. So I've stopped and tried every vehicle, but there's only been a couple that have given me any gas. I should, I think, God, I hope so, have enough to make it home. We'll just have to see. Put you in here. It's not going to give us much. We're at 29%. I don't even know how much further we have to go. We're not too far. We're not too terribly far from the house. I think we should be able to get there. I don't remember how much I had when we left. It definitely wasn't a full tank, but I guess worst case scenario, if I don't work it, if I don't make it there, I can run it all the way to empty, run to the house, get my motor, my mini bike, drive back with some gas, fill it up and carry one of the two back and then call it that way. Look at that. We made it. 2% gas left in this bad boy, and we made it. You know what? I got a lot of unloading of stuff to do. I'm just going to put you right here in the front door so I can kind of go back and forth. Make sure nobody's been inside. We're good. First things first, 
I want to get some water. <laughs> I'm, we can't believe we made it. I can't believe we actually made it over here. And, of course, I need to take some antibiotics. The honey I had earlier did not solve it. I thought it would. It doesn't always work. I think I have some just basic antibiotics in here, like one of these. Boom. Well, hold on. Herbal antibiotics does 10%. We're at 9.3. Let me go ahead and use you. Whew. Okay, guys. That's going to do it for today, unfortunately. I... <laughs> Today was rough. Today was a rough freaking day. I'm not going to lie. But we made it home safe and soundish. And anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor and leave a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you're not already. So you don't miss out on future videos. And click the little bell. You get notified when new videos go live, of course. And in the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day. And I will talk to you later.